Alright, welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare on the PC this time. I actually recorded quite a few rounds before. Uh, this is not my first round on the PC, but I did record my first few rounds on the PC, but they were kind of different experiences because I was dealing with some of the issues that came with the PC version. Now, I should say that the PC version is actually a pretty solid release. It's got a lot of options in there that you would expect from, you know, uh, from a PC release. You know, it's not just like a really crappy port. By the same time, it's got terrible, terrible woes of a, of a, of a port. Uh, and one of those issues is the fact that you don't have a push-to-talk option. Now, it's been like, uh, let me move out of the way here. Well, looks like I'm gonna die, actually. No! Please don't kill me! I'm trying to talk! Alright, we'll let that guy just kinda sit around and die? Or die, you know, whatever. I'm driving a dude. Oh, I got him just in time! Anyways, so there's no push to talk option, basically. And you can't, and your mic, so your mic's always on. And everybody else's mic is always on. And so you get this really crap experience where you join a server, and you just hear stuff. You know, and it's, it varies from round to round. Some rounds, you get relatively quiet people. Uh, but you still have that noise. You still, <coughs> you still have that background noise. <coughs> oh, God. And that's awful. That's awful. Now, there are ways around having your mic turn on, uh, which is great, because honestly, I can talk in front of a thousand people, but if there are, if there's one person around me who I do not want to listen, that's awkward. I'm not gonna do a fucking commentary, you know, who, with a person who who doesn't even know who the hell I am. <laughs> you know, that's just that's just my general views on the thing. So my first few rounds, uh, I'm just not even gonna bother posting them up. <laughs> they're just they're weird. And I'm a little bit sad actually that oh I'm dead. I'm a little sad that it's been like a week uh, since the game came out on the PC. And there hasn't been a patch that just like immediately fixed it because I don't I don't know I just feel like oh another thing you can't type you can't type on a PC release uh, and It's like they, they fully expect you to use Your mic or something and that makes no sense to me that doesn't make sense to me It's on frostbite first of all so if there's no typing in that oof. not that battlefield's ever had good typing Battlefield 2 had shitty typing, Battlefield 2142 had shitty typing, all the bad company games had shitty typing. And by that I mean like, there would be a lot of times where I'm typing into the chat, and half of my shit doesn't get registered. And it doesn't make sense, but it's the only game that ever did that. Battlefield 4 kind of fixed it, but Battlefield 4 had a lot of issues everywhere else, so I can't compliment that too much. Oh no! Not the spike weed! I'm- I'm- I, I'm alive, I'm alive. I'm alive. Okay, I thought I was gonna die there. I almost did. They're gonna break the teleporter! Well, while they break the teleporter, I'll be over here, just reviving my- Oh, no, nope, he's gone. Well, hopefully my teammate comes back. Laser drive! Please, there you go. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Has a health thing next to the teleporter, so, you know, someone comes through, they're all injured and stuff, they just start getting healed. Or maybe, you know, you're defending the place, and you don't want, you know, your zombie friends to die, that's always great too. But yeah, beyond the few issues, uh, the PC release is actually pretty solid. The aiming is relatively one-to-one. -one. I don't feel like a hell of a lot of mouse acceleration. And after playing Watch Dogs, which had fuckloads of it, uh, there's a difference. <laughs> there is definitely a difference. And that's nice. I like actually being able to go, oh, I want to shoot my shot over there. Listen, buddy. <laughs> Who do you think you are? I'm trying to give my explanation. You know what? I'm gonna taunt over him. Yeah, hi, how's it going? Mm-hmm. I lost all the things I had, you know. I but I guess to be fair, they let you if you pre-ordered the game, they gave you like 150,000 coins, which was nice. Uh I wish they had given me 300,000 coins because I've hardly got anything decent out of them. But yeah, no, whatever. I, I just figured I just wish there was a way, you know, like if you had the Xbox One version. It'd be cool if they registered it so that way you could just easily check it out. And I want that guy to die. And I hope this hits him. Oh, no. It got close, though. Come on! 
Yeah, stand right fucking there. Stay right there. Don't move ever. God. No, not the spike weed. Oh, the spike weed. Damn it. Well, at least I'm getting revived. I don't know who by, but it's not a doctor, that's for sure. All right, teamwork. You gotta stand the point. Come on, fellas. We gotta make sure these silly little plants can't win. Now, one thing to also note is that, uh, holy shit, there are so many different classes now. Oh, hello. Speaking of classes, we got this asshole, the Citrus class. I think there's like a Fanta deal going on or something, but you got some free classes uh, for two things I didn't care about. I was like, oh, well, okay, thanks for the free class, I guess. I don't know why I'd want a, a themed berry class, but I'll take it, you know? All right, you gotta stop. Oh, he's dead. I'm on fire. I'm on fire and dying. Okay. I didn't realize how low my health was. Uh, but yeah, no, if, if there was a chatting feature and you could push to talk, I think this would be a pretty good release. And you know, as I said a lot uh, when we played Plants vs. Zombies, Garden Warfare, uh, when it was on, when it first released on the Xbox One, I think that this is a pretty good experience. This is a pretty fun experience. It looks really good. It looks even better on the PC. Look at this. Just, ah. Oh. You can't see shit on YouTube, but, you know, I'm running at 1920 by 10, or 1920 by, yeah, 1920 by 1080, I almost said 1920 by 1280, which would have been weird. But I'm playing at 1920 by 1080, everything's maxed out, any listing is cranked up to the max, and everything just looks smooth. And it's all running, I'm sure, over 60 FPS, because I can feel that it feels over 60 FPS, and that's great. You know, I don't know what it ran at on the Xbox One, or the Xbox 360. Oh shit. I pressed the wrong button! <laughs> I pressed three instead of two. Oh, that's unfortunate. But anyways, continuing on, like I was saying, uh, it just feels good, you know? I'm fucking, it's like, oh yeah, it's gonna play this game. Everything's gonna look beautiful. Everything's gonna look next gen. I could spin around. Everything's gonna be maxed out. Awesome. And that's all there is to it, really. Of course, again, like I said, there are so many fucking classes in the game now. I don't know what half the shit that's flying at me is. You know, I get hit by something and I'm getting poison damage. I'm like, that wasn't in there months ago when I first played the game. <laughs> you know? I'm like, I see, you know, they, they had a pretty solid PC. Oh, hello. They had a pretty solid PC release schedule. Um, by that I mean, you know, it's the beginning of the summer. So, if you're getting on the PC, it's like, yeah, you get a chance to just chill out a little bit. Maybe it doesn't matter too much, but it, it, it's just nice timing. I like when things are, um... Oh, I fucked up. Well, maybe I can throw this straight up and have it fall and in an arc. Okay. You know, I've learned things. I've learned many things. I'm poisoned. Why do you have to do this to me? <laughs> I was just gonna run into the spike weed and waste it. Alright, well, you know what? Fine. I'm gonna be a dick. I'm gonna check out what other classes I've got. Change character. Okay. So, I don't really have anything else, which is sad because I think I had a few different classes that I actually liked. Um... The Xbox One, that's a shame. Oh, PC version on the PC, or boss mode on the PC. Yeah, this should, this is, this is exactly the same kind of experience. This is meh. What a shame that they couldn't do something really cool. Uh, but you know what, at least we can do this, we can spot. And it's actually easier to, like, grab all the things. It's like playing the PC version of Plants vs. Zombies again. You're just like, yeah, I'll just mouse over things and whoosh, there you go! Haha! -ha. Now, if I want to, like, say... Heal up people, I just drag it over here on top of them like that. Boom, there you go! It did not land anywhere where I wanted to. It landed on top of a building. God, why couldn't it be 3D? Why couldn't I, I you know, I wish there was an option to say, hey, I want to do 3D boss mode and actually see what's going on here rather than just only getting snippets of it how boring is this how infuriatingly boring is it to sit here and go man i sure wish i could see the actual action on the ground because that would be entertaining well, that would make it a hell of a lot more worth it because you're sitting there going yeah i gotta i can see exactly where people are but instead nope 
You know, it just reminds me of Battlefield 2. Battlefield 2 had a system where you could zoom down and see action happening, and it was cool. Because you were like, alright, I'm gonna bomb this specific point, and I'm gonna zoom in and look around it. And it was cool. It was just- it was just cool, alright? But, alright, I think- I think we're done with this. I'm gonna go ahead and plop down a couple more things. I want to make sure my team is being supported by stuff before I exit this mode. Maybe I'll get another airstrike down, because airstrikes are always good. Airstrikes are always fantastic. Come on, one more, one more. Oh, right, the cooldown! God, cooldowns too! It's like DICE when they figure, or I don't think, I don't know if DICE developed Plants vs. Zombies, but everyone who at EA who's been doing these commander modes, it's like they forgot what fun is. <laughs> you know? You're like, alright, here's what we gotta do. We have to have it so they have ridiculously awesome stuff to use and everything. And then the guys at EA are like, no, that'd be overpowered. We can't have a guy just in the sky dropping badass things on the field. That'd be... No, it's gotta be, meh. They can drop an, an occasional airstrike, it won't do anything important, but, you know, it'll exist. It can do some damage. Oh no, they're shooting me! Alright, we're getting out of that because fucking holy tits poured out of my eyes. Okay, so I'm gonna we'll just play as the foot soldier because as much as I like shooting high damaging rockets at people, sometimes it's just... Shooting them down with an assault rifle is fun too. Also, we only have 30 seconds. Maybe I can turn it around. Maybe by myself I can help my teammates capture glory. That'd be pretty solid. I'd like that. I highly doubt it, but you know, it could happen. Oh, he's gone. Aha! Aha! I'm just gonna stand in the point. Standing in the point. Standing in the point. I'm gonna die. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe. Oh! Oh shit! Maybe we'll survive! Come on, teammates, you can do it! Clear out the point! Yeah, they died. I was so excited, but we only got halfway there. Three of th three out of six. <laughs> I've only seen the garden maps be completed a few times. Or the... Is it gar gar gardens and graveyard maps? I've only seen those completed a few times. It's such a shame. But oh well, I got enough points for the spectacular character pack. Oh, here we go. The citrus cactus. This is one of the things I got unlocked today. It was free, it was just in the sticker book, and they're like, hey, check out this thing, and I'm like, I have no idea what you want me to do. They're like adding advertisement DLC characters. Which don't even do much. They're just like, hey, these are themed. And I go, sweet! Thanks for the free character! I don't know what the hell you're advertising, but cool. Oh! I got another zombie class! That's good, I guess. I mean, I don't need another soldier. I would've loved something else, but hey, you take what you can get, right? I might as well fill this up. Yeah! I got a couple of items I might like, although I didn't get any- mmm, darn. I wanted, um, some reinforcements, zombie reinforcements, because I don't really spawn that many, but because I really don't have much at all. But I have to fix this. I guess we can do that over the next rounds.